Massive construction work is ongoing at the project site of the Museum of West African Arts MOA on Sapler Road in Benin City. Governor Baseki, who noted that the Jangatic project, when completed, will create jobs for the teaming youth, said it will also help showcase globally the history and rich cultural heritage of Edo State. Beyond the physical structure, you can see from the exhibition that has been mounted by the Museum of West African Arts that a lot of thought, a lot of work has gone into helping us understand the rich history and culture of Edo through the various media and schemes like archaeology, going into the details of the sort of materials. All of these are to help us understand and explain who we are, how we developed the society, the systems, and the greatness which Edo and Benin is known for. Mr. Baseki appreciated both local and international partners who have contributed immensely towards the success of the project. He reiterated his administration's commitment to make Edo a cultural tourism hub. This is perhaps the most transformational project our government would be involved in uh, since we came into office. And I'm so glad that we found partners, both local and international partners, who believe in this project and have contributed immensely to making sure that this project sees the light of day. These are all people who are going to be part of this whole new cultural renaissance in Edo. As we build Edo into a cultural tourism hub, they're going to create more jobs. Governor Baseki disclosed that his administration is working towards diversifying the state's economy and added that the tourism orb, when completed, will attract tourists, thereby boosting the internally generated revenue. Patience, Osaugiwa, ITV News.